Hello friends. In this tutorial, we will see multi-section solid command. Okay. The multi-section solid command can be created by joining two or more sections curve along the user-defined guiding curves. Okay. One or more guiding curves can be used. Okay. Let's start the session. First of all, open the Katia software. Click on start. Mechanical design, part design. Okay, and okay. Here, we will create a first of all a plane from offset to this ZX plane. Select a ZX plane and enter the offset is 100 again. Enter. Okay. Now we will select uh, the ZX plane and click on sketch command. Okay. Here we will create a rectangle. Okay. Now click on exit workbench. Now select a new created reference element, uh, reference plane. Select and click on OK. And click on fit all in. Okay. Now here create another rectangle bigger than first one. Okay. Now click on exit workbench command here. Now we will select the perpendicular plane to both profiles. The perpendicular plane is YZ. Select YZ plane, click on sketch command. Okay. Now here we will create a two profiles, two guidelines. First select okay and uh, escape. Select this point and this point and click on constant defined definition box. Click coincide. Okay. Same this. Okay. okay. Now click on exit workbench and again select the YZ plane and click create another guideline. Okay. Now select this. Click on escape. Okay, now select uh, both points and click on a constraint definer block uh, command and coincide. Okay, same this. Okay, now click on exit workbench. Here, this is a multi section solid command. Okay, select multi section solid command. Here, this is a selected profiles is shown in this block and the guidelines are shown in this block here the four types first one is guide second one is pin third one is coupling fourth one is real limitation okay we will first of all we will see guide after that we will see one by one okay first of all we will see guide here first of all we will select the profiles This is a profile one. This is profile two. Okay. Now select the guidelines. Select here, and this is the first guide one and guide two. Okay. Now create preview. Okay. Like this, the guide is used. Okay. Now we will see spin option. Okay. Click OK. Now we will see spin option. Select a XY plane. Okay. Select a sketch command. Okay. And Select a circle command and 
create a circle okay now click on exit workbench okay now we will select a yz plane okay and create a profile okay and escape control z click select a spline okay now we will click on exit workbench command okay now here select a reference plane command and select a this point and it here select a normal to curve okay and this is a curve okay now preview okay on this plane create a circle fit all in and here select a circle select this and this point and coincide with each other okay click on exit workbench command okay now we will see select a multi section solid select a both profiles and select a spin here the select a spin and the point clo closing points arrow in different side that's why the prof the uh, spin is not created now this arrow of the closing point is in this side and this arrow is closing point in this side click on this arrow and preview okay now see the spin is created okay click on okay see okay like this the spin option is used now we will see coupling option okay first of all create a reference plane okay from this plane okay enter 550 offset okay now on this plane we will create a first profile okay uh, we will create a circle okay now we will create a four points on this circle okay first is at here preview okay okay next is we will create at here click okay third is we will create at here click okay now last is we will create it at here okay okay now on another profile we will create a rectangle profile okay fit all in and we will create a okay and exit click on exit workbench okay now first of all select the multi section solid command okay and select a coupling okay now here select the profiles okay these two profiles okay now see the direction of closing point okay now here select a here and select a points okay this point to this point okay this point to this point this point to this point okay and this point to this point okay now
click on preview okay see like this the coupling option is used okay click okay see like this the coupling option is used okay thank you